Let's make us a day cheese peanut butter soup or in cotton coin you will love this recipe trust me it was very simple easy quick but above all very delicious if today is the first time here we do easy cooking recipes and welcome to my kitchen please do not forget to follow me on all social media platforms at Elizabeth and mommy's recipes it is free okay thank you so much now let's get started i have with me here my homemade peanut butter i have the recipe on my youtube channel and facebook page please check it out and you will love it then i'll go ahead and add my homemade tomato paste i'll mix it very well and then we proceed my name is lena and do not make it the last time of visiting okay thank you so much so after we've got into this outcome here i'm just going to add some water to it and mix it very well before we can proceed so now it is on fire okay and i'll go ahead and give it a stir and then cover it for some time okay it will surely stick to the pan but you just have to make sure it, it doesn't start early okay <laughs> that is just by the way so we are doing this so that we will be able to cook the peanut butter very well you know if it is not well cooked oh my goodness we have to just bring you <laughs> all the tissue papers that you need for your restroom because you will be visiting the restroom anyhow so you need to cook your peanut butter very well okay you need to cook it very well and when you don't want this method you can just go ahead and add it to your meat or whatever protein that you are using straight away and then you are good to go so we are done with the frying and i scoop some oil from it i will use it for my stew okay i've added some water to it i will set it aside and we are cooking our vegetables that you saw on the screen now i have all my proteins here okay i love tuna in my peanut butter soup okay but do you know the funny thing <laughs> I have never tasted tuna before. <laughs> yes, but if you use it for peanut butter soup, it is so good. The soup tastes good. Okay. Yes. Now, I seasoned it with my homemade season that I made and I added some salt to it as well. Now, I've poured the peanut butter that we fried and we added um, water to it. I've added it to the puddings. Okay. And I will just give it a stir and then we proceed if you are still with me and you haven't followed yet or subscribed yet please what are you waiting for can you please do so for me as i said earlier it is free so use any protein of your choice and you are good to go so at this moment i am just going to add my homemade natural spice again add my seasoning add anything that will add um, taste to the soup we've blended our uh, um, vegetables and i've added that to the soup the soup looks very delicious already but it is not ready okay yes so we are just going to leave it on fire for some time when you are preparing um peanut butter soup you have to be very careful I'll be adding the pepper to it later okay there are some people who like a lot of pepper <laughs> so when they are they are enjoying the soup they can mash it okay but before that let me share this with you i am just going to add my um macro in tomato sauce oh my goodness it took the soup to another level but you can't feel the peanut butter in too much okay so let me explain it further before you try it now I've added my fish. So it tasted like lye soup and peanut butter soup. It was so delicious. That is how it tasted. Okay. So one thing cuts the any woman too much. Okay. You won't taste uh, only the peanut butter, like how you prepare peanut butter soup and you can you can taste it very well. But this was just like a combination of 
light soup and peanut butter and it was so delicious yes i loved it and i know you will love it as well so let me know the outcome if you try it so i come your way next time always remember i love you take good care of yourself love yourself first and see you in the next video bye bye <laughs>